Right then guys, this is just a quick up link from yesterday about the bait now it's uh, finished. This this is what it uh, looks like. I've rolled it in actually two, two sizes now. I've mixed them up for the simple reason I've been fishing short range at, at um, next place I fish. So it's, uh, well, when I say short range, probably 60, 60, 65 yards, 70 yards. And I know these will get out of there, so. Now I've rolled them in, in 16 millimeter round, round baits. Now the black flecks you can see in there are kelp. The white flex, flecks are coconut. And the red, the red yard, red and black. Majority is, is black. It, it, it black bloodworm. It, it goes into a black, black color later, later on. The longer you have it, it, it goes blacker. So it's, it's looking really good. I will be honest with you. It's, it's got black pepper in there. It's got kelp. It, like I said, it's got coconut. It smells. A very subtly of banana, it's not a strong smell of banana, very so, which I wanted. Didn't want it to be too over, too over pungent, because this, I'm rolling these now for Ova Valley. And I didn't want it to be too over pungent, because when last time I fished here, I noticed that the buys were coming on the second night. And I, I think I said that in the last video on that. What I did notice about that was, it weren't just a one-off that it weren't just a one-off at all it's sometimes the bites would come after the after the baits we get there at about eight o'clock in the morning and the baits would the, the bites would come about eight o'clock at night then i'm convinced it was after them baits had been washed out a bit they were just a little bit too strong back then it's not been like that i've not done them that strong for a long long time apart from if i'm pre-baiting now if i'm pre-baiting I like to know that I'm putting bait in that's strong smelling, that's going to stay in that pit for, for, for a long period of time, and it's um, it, it's going to be all right for at least twenty four hours. Not nothing's going to nothing's going to bother some of guys about that. It's can't go in that. So not nothing's going to bother like, like I was saying. Nothing's going to bother with it for at least twenty four hours. Now the other thing is. Oh, well, we're lucky find a little bit of pace has got in there. So the other thing with it is, it, with it being a nice eye, eye full value bait, it's, um, I've got a funny feeling that they're going to come back for this. Now it's, I've been, every year I roll a bait specifically just for, just for my own use. Last year it was bloody pineapple. Now I used that right up until late on, probably, Round about August time, and then I decided that there were a few on there that that were struggling, and I decided that I'd, I'd give them an helping hand and, I, and, I, and I'd offer them a bit. But with the knowing in my head that we with our the watercraft, the the bait is that no matter what bait you use, it, it's 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 a waste of time. No matter what bait you use, it's a waste of time. If you ain't got the the the, the watercraft to to, uh, to 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 find find nice fishing spots where your rigs are sat and they're fishing effectively. It, it it's pointless. It's your best bait in the world on it, and, and you know you ain't gonna do anything. Now the lad, you can see the bloodworm in it there. See it, guys. There, the piece there sticking out, and there's also a piece in it there. It's um. Now the guys I sell it to, they did really well towards the end on it because they were doing longer than 24 hours. They were sitting on bait, they were putting bait out there, kilo bait out there, half a kilo bait out there. Or, or sometimes just, just an handful, an handful of bait. I mean, I, I've caught down there over, over 20, 30 freebies. I've caught several times down there doing that, but I've also... What what people don't forget is when I when I go down and I put that many baits out, they think I'm fishing over that much bait. No, I'm not not fishing over that much bait whatsoever. It's through the week. At least at least one of them has gone out through the week, which is that's about two and a half kilo. So at least one of them's gone out to, to, through the week, consistent like drip feeding it in, in not in one big eight of of bait like that. 
it's gone out in 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 probably four four visits down there it's gone out in bits drip feeding it in and and eventually when you get down there you sometimes actually see the tails of the fish and the, the tails are up and the, the, the heads are down it's clouded in fact to the point of that happened to me a few times where i couldn't even get a rig in because they were that they were that on me i had to wait for them to drift out get rigging and then they come back in now now the other thing with with these baits is with me not doing them for anyone else it's it's just a little thing you can can learn for your own fishing and it is that if if you roll a bait solely for your own purposes it gives you a massive edge on any pit you fish or any pond you fish it gives you a massive edge because for the simple reason of you know that nobody else has put that bait in the attraction it is leaking even though it, it's a very very similar bait to, to Bonoffi it's also very different as well it's got high levels of blood there's a lot of blood worm in it and it's, it's double the amount looks the, the the amount of coconut in there there's a lot of, uh, of uh, black pepper and chili in which there isn't any of, of that in in Bonoffi because i don't see the need really to do to do to do that with Bonoffi Bonoffi is a um a bit, i've never really had problems with, with uh, other species and i will be honest with you now the black pepper in this is is because i will be fishing the margins so it it's solely really to, to to try and cut down on them bream it's i ain't a fan of catching bream no matter what 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 time of day it is unless i don't mind catching them if they're really big but i ain't seen nothing come out of tree and bream wise that is on par with fish that come out of rover valley the ones come out of rover valley are absolutely mutants and i don't mind catching them bring up bring up double figures over 10 pound of a very nice fish to have so i don't mind catching them but the thing is is again another thing is we never had much we did it one day i went on there and i used particles now it was it was probably the best it a carp i've ever had on there i think i had something like seven seven or eight fish in one day in well in 48 hours on robber valley and it was fishing over a massive bed of boilers and also a massive bed of particles i had something like i think i had something like eight seven or eight carp and I think I had something like, it, it, it were double figures, insert brain numbers or whatever, and the smallest one was £7. So that gives you an idea of the brain size in, in Rava Valley. So, But that's the bait I'll be using this year, guys. And it, it's a, um, a bait called Banana Split. But I won't be selling it. it it's it's a bit i won't be selling for the, for the simple reason of i don't know what it's what it's going to work like it it's and i want it solely for my own own use now i know i've just said i know it, i know i don't know what it's going to be like i know what it's going to be like it's going to be a deadly bit i know it is just from the smell and from what's in it it's it's like i said it before it's very much like an offer it's so and I, I know what it's gonna be like, it's gonna be deadly. So the 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 thing is, is I want a bait solely for my own use. But if you are wanting a bait with very similar attraction to this, then I do it. I do bait with very similar attraction to this, but very slightly different. Uh, uh, this is very different to, to 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 most of the baits I do. The other one as well is the cut the, the, the sweet corn bait that I'm doing, the cocoa uh, Coco corn oh. is that one's not getting put out there yet either. I think I'm gonna save that one back as well because there's just too many on on the on menu at the minute and it, it's hard work keeping up with them all. So I'm gonna to stick to 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 those ones and I'm gonna flip the, the the ones that I've got that are on now. The pineapple, the, the pineapple, the banoffee the KBS and the liver and, and uh, shrimp are, are the baits that, that will be for sale. So have a good day guys, I'll check you later.